What's up guys? Welcome back to update number two. I'm I'm with with Big Bees. Yo, yo, yo. And um the the other guy who who I was also gonna feature is not here, but you know well but um it's probably smaller smaller video this time. Definitely not as much as last time, but you know, it's been like three weeks. So, um, Big Bees has been uh, up to a lot of things, and um, we're gonna go to that first. But um, peep the skyline. Skyline's looking cool. Peep it. Uh, lots of not not a lot. Few new buildings, but um, what Mr. Bees over here has been working on is not related to any of that. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna fly there. It's taking quite a while, but um, he's all the way over there by his uh, old racetrack, which is still there for honorary purposes, but he has been working on the Gotham Heights district, which is where all the rich people have their nice mansions, and eventually is probably going to be where the university is too, but for now, he fully made this one, he's already there, he fully made this mansion, and he's starting the next one. All right, you can take over now. All right, so uh, um, this mansion right here, you know, it's white. Uh, it has three floors. Um, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna build the road right here. Probably should have built the road first to map out uh the building structure better, but you know I didn't do that, so we learned from our mistakes. But uh. As you can see, when we walk in, it's very open. Uh, we have a nice uh, big uh, chandelier, and we have a nice uh, dining room table. Uh, we can come over here to the kitchen. Uh, we got some fridge, some stoves. Uh, it is feeling a little empty, so I might put a little like island in the middle, but we'll see, we'll see. Um, and then as you come over here on this side, we have a little fireplace with just a, a couch and some chairs. And then um, right over here we have the library. That's two floors. And then if you come over here to the staircases, uh, later on uh, when I decide to do it, I'm going to make a, like a wine cellar. And then uh, let's go up to the second floor. So... On the second floor, you can see we have some nice paintings. Uh, we have the, you can see the downstairs. And then over here, we have uh, this room, it's like a bedroom. You know, we have shelves, table. And then over here, we have the first bathroom. We got our toilet, our, our sink, all that. And then if you come out this way, you can go over here to the second room. Over here we have a, a Minecraft inspired room. It has a you know a bed, a nice little self-destruct button. We got it we got our windows. And then we got a little nice big walk-in closet. He's got all his, his drip, some storage, you know. And then if we come out this way, we can go up to the second floor. Uh, I haven't done too much here yet because I kind of got bored of doing interior and I kind of wanted to start the second house. So once I get to feeling like doing interior, I'm going to do the interior to the rooms. But so far I have this fireplace with a couch and we have a storage room. And I believe we have the second bathroom done. Yeah, I have the second bathroom <laughs> done. We got a big bathtub, <laughs> double sink. And, uh, you know, the toilet. And then over here, this is empty for now, but I'm going to build a nice room in here. And these other two rooms are empty also, I believe, yet. Yeah, I didn't build anything in those yet. But once I get around to it, I'm going to build rooms in each one of these. Where'd I started go? the bed for this one. I just realized I started the bed. But we wanted, I wanted to start the second house already, so... Eventually, that's going to get done once I feel like doing it, but I wanted to start this. Hey, peep the view from here. I mean, at least, wow. 
skylight. Okay, cool. All right, All right what, what um, else we got? We got the backyard. We got the backyard. So, so we go, oh, we long can, door. We go Actually, through, yeah, okay. Yeah. So then you can see uh, this is going to be like, uh, this is going to be the driveway area. I'm probably going to build some cars, you know, some nice little old-fashioned cars. You'd get your car if you were rich and lived in this house. You'd, you'd walk down this way. We got a little, like, walk-around kind of dirt track for horses. And we got a kind of old-style Victorian garden. That's what I was going for. And then we got our horses over here. We got some beautiful horses with a nice uh, horse stable and some hay all around, you know. Yep. And then if we come over here, I got the second house going. Uh, it's not done yet. I'm barely starting it. You see, I started the windows. Oh, nice, I'm trying nice. to figure out how I like it. I think I like it like this, but we might change it. Um, it's going to probably be three, maybe four stories high. We have a little, like, uh, like, kind of a dock it's more of a yeah it's kind of like a dock but there's gonna be another dock this one's just kind of to come out there will be like a table out here eventually you know they could have dinner it's it's kind of like a porch balcony type thing and then um over here i'm gonna make a little walkway out to here and i'm probably gonna make a dock right here and i might uh extend the ocean to right here and probably get rid of some of these mountains or i might put the dock over here and I'm going to put a little mini yacht, maybe some jet skis, because, you know, they're rich, so they'll be able to afford it. And then, uh, yeah, that's my plan for this house. And I'm probably going to put another house over here with another dock, delete some of that uh, mountain range and change it to ocean. And, yeah, that'll be, that'll be coming pretty soon. And then I'll start working on the other houses and make a whole neighborhood. Sick. Sick, sick, sick. Yeah. So, um, yeah, this whole area, um, it's going to be all uh, wealthy residential. And as I said, the school might be somewhere here. I don't know. We might cover up the water, but, or you make it big open water. But um, the uh, road to Wayne Island will also be from there and connect somewhere here. But, um, yeah, Big B's been working hard. Building these houses. Yep. He wanted to take a break from the city building, so um, he's over there. But with the city, um, showed all of this last time. Um, take me a second to get there. So, quite a big city, but um, yeah. So. The other guy, who we still don't know what to call yet, um, he um, he made two new buildings to help fill up the lots. So he made this one, which is just pretty direct and pretty simple, which is nice. Not too convoluted or anything. And then he also made this one, which he started and then I finished it. So he did all like the base design and stuff, and then I kind of carved out these statues and stuff. And the lamps and all that, but um, yeah. So we're back in Burnley. Um, there's a a lot of development. Um, I diversified the roads, if you want to call it that. Roads look a lot more interesting now. I added some cars. As you see, I'm I'm in the process of copying them around. Um, I made this big old Gotham sign, which. I think it really fits the style, but um, yeah, let me talk about the two buildings first. So yeah, let's look at the um, the individual buildings that unnamed teams member made. So he made this one basically um, all on his own. He asked for like a little bit of like how tall we should make it, and at first he made it like that tall, but then I was like. I'm pretty, like, I think it would look better because it was taller because I think it would, like, mesh better with the whole landscape. Um, yeah, so he made this. He made the roof. The roof looks nice. And then I added these, uh, whatever these things are. I really, I don't know what to call them, but they just kind of fit the vibe. 
to like connect the buildings in a sort of way. But yeah, there's this. I moved the Riddler copter a lot higher. It was like right here initially, I think. Um, yeah, this building now. Um, yeah, I asked him to put like make another building here, and he wasn't so sure how to start it. But then he like asked or he thought that like if we like if he um did this like awning type design again over here but a different color and I think it worked out pretty well and it looks like like there's a theme going on and it works but at the same time it's like it's the same thing so I, I think it looks nice and he did pretty good there um yeah then this second section he had it unfinished so I finished it up and added the statues and then I added this roof part and these lamps. I like the lamps because it's something new. And yeah, not a super tall building, but a lot of interesting things going on with it. So I do like how it looks among the other ones. And um, what was I going to say? Yeah, so this building that he also made, I added the GCN sign because um, there's not too many buildings with like wording on it. And. Um, I think this one, especially since it was just all brown, I think it could have used a little bit of contrast. And this isn't like, I guess, if we really wanted to, it wouldn't be the GCN, but it's like a GCN building, I guess. But yeah, Gotham sign. Um, I enjoyed making that. That was a lot of fun. And yeah, you can see it on both sides. Uh, we built our first like crosswalk intersection here, like ever. Like, we never put the white lines down or anything, but we just, I think he did it just to see, and it looks cool, though. But yeah, um, the cars and the road looking all scrappy is just, like, just to see, that's more like an end stage thing when we're done with everything, but, um, you know, it's not gonna be for a while, so might as well just check it out. Um, yeah, this whole area is all new, this is what I've been working on. Um, this is the oldest one here out of everything, so this is, um... I don't know how, what to call it, but like, um, well, this whole area, I wanted it to make, like, pedestrian friendly, so, it's really walkable, like, uh, this stairway here, that you take, it's kind of bare still, I'm gonna add, like, benches and stuff, maybe, um, this is also unfinished, I haven't finished this yet, but, um, there's a chimney here, there's a tunnel that goes all the way through, and this, you could walk along the train station and walk along here. And, yeah, so this building has a, a billboard, which is for, like, Gotham rails or something for the train. That train is supposed to look like, um, this train. I mean, it's not exactly the same, but, like, it's got the same idea. I already showed it, so, um, yeah, I'm going to show this. Uh, working on the Gotham Square part, everything, you know below sea level, so, um, I made the, what's the word, canal, like, a little bit, like, nastier, and it leads to here, which is, like, I don't know, water control or something, I'm gonna probably add a little more here, and then there's just this, like, design, not really practical, but it's, like, Burton Schumachery looking design with this, uh, gate wall here to keep people out and then I made this stairwell it says to Burnley and this is how you get up and down from the levels this says to Gotham Square and then yeah I'm gonna go from here for this part um yeah well I mean I never really finished that building but I'll go through here I'm going through this really sporadically um this building uh, also very, like, what's the word, um, uh, I don't know, but it's, like, really fantastical, I guess. It's got the round bits, and then it, like, stoops out multiple ways. Um, then it's got chimneys, and then it goes even higher with, this is, like, the super chimney building. I put, like, a thousand chimneys on it, it looks cool. 
And then, yeah, you could see it like that with the empire in the background. That's sick. I like that. And then, um, yeah, domes. But yeah, there's a bunch of chimneys. There's this one, and then there's the two giant smokestacks, which go from the bottom. And then there's another one, these two more right here. I put all these, like, pipings on the back and stuff. And then, yeah, so this parking lot is for this building, Ocarin Industries. I don't even know what Ocarin Industries is. I just searched it up on the wiki. And I, well, I searched up companies on the wiki, and I found it. And it was, like, a defense contractor or something, which is, like, the kind of company that I wanted for this big, like, menacing-looking building. So, um, yeah, and I really like the way the font turned out really... I wouldn't say modern, but really a uh, like clean cut. But um, yeah, I was saying with that building, GCN is that like there's not a lot of wording going on in this area, so um, I think it looks nice. Like it clashes well with the the rest of the skyline, and it's um it, it's like a more modern looking building, but it's not like super modern. But yeah, I wanted it to have, like, kind of the redundancy, but also be asymmetrical, where it's, like, kind of everything's offset a little bit. But, yeah, the parking lot would be for that, those people. Um, there's this, like, little rooftop terrace thing, where I guess, like, you'd have, like, a party or something. And the other side had, like, solar panels and a generator or something. But yeah, this building, I didn't really finish. Um, this is a super uneven building. Nothing about this building is like even. All the windows are offset. And it kind of doesn't make sense, which is what I was going for. So I kind of really like it. And um, we have the ledges and stuff. I think I would I would say it's like Burtony, but I wouldn't know. I wouldn't be too sure. It's just... I'm just attributing those asymmetrical and fantastical looks. I'll also put another bat wing up here above a Big Bees' old building. You can see the shadow. That's kind of funny. Oh, I, was, I was seeing that the other day when I came by. I was like, what the heck is that? It's so high up. Like, I don't know. I always think that nothing is that high up when I built this. And, like, you really go high up and you realize that everything's high up. But, yeah. Um, Snyder bat wing. I've got bored, so I built this. But, um, you can see everything from up here. Um, yeah, I think there's just one more thing, which I literally started today and a few days ago. Am um, I mapping out, like, the building, like, structures here for Gotham Square? Because they're weird and they're diagonal and they go down and up and down. It's weird. So, I just started that. But, um,. Here's Grand Avenue, which is really like the last big part of this whole island. And I did the intersection a few days ago, but I just started this, uh, the Black Canary Club thing. But yeah, this will take a while, undoubtedly. But um, we'll get started on that as the me new main thing. But here's the intersection. And. After that's done, a little bit more of the Gotham Square with, like, the garden and some buildings. The island should be good with the zoo, too, which we've been putting off for about, like, two years now. But, um, I think that'll do it for this video. I didn't show the horse, though. I want to show the horse. Yeah, I spent, like, a good 15 minutes on this horse yesterday, or two days ago. I actually don't think it looks too bad. Did you see this yet? Yeah, it's... it's, it's actually, it actually looks pretty good. <laughs> Dude, when I first started it without a reference picture, it looked so bad. I was like, what even is this? But I used a reference picture of a horse on his two legs, and I was like, hmm, that looks pretty good. But, um... You know, it is pretty good. Yeah. But, Did you show off this? The train station? Yeah, the train station was in the last video. Yeah. But, um, I think that'll do it. Um, yeah, so Big B's is going to keep working on the Gotham Heights, the residential stuff, and me and unnamed person who still won't get on a video, even though he's been doing a lot. We'll be doing the rest of the city, for now, at least.
but um yeah thanks for the patience i know we don't upload too much but i don't know progress isn't like super fast but we'll keep working on it because we want to finish this within the next few months so hey summer 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 just started so summer just started we gotta get to work but um yeah i hope you guys enjoyed that one um we see all the comments and stuff it's great and all the growth we appreciate it so um yeah we'll see you guys soon with the new update or maybe something else who knows but thanks for watching this one and uh see you next time